What? You've never had Korean shrimp chips before? Well, don't miss out because once it hits the lips, you will not be able to stop. Crunchy and airy that I just feel like I need to go have more. It just disappeared in my mouth so fast. Shh, don't tell the others. But I'm going to share a beer hack using Korean shrimp chips. And why am I whispering? I don't know. Welcome to Modern Pepper's vlog series where we discuss everything related to Korean food, ingredients, kitchen gadgets, and more. Hi I'm everyone, this is Modern Helen and welcome and to Modern Pepper. So what does it taste like? It sounds odd to call it shrimp chips because it doesn't really taste like shrimps per se. That's the original one. It's very crunchy but super airy. And then the saltiness is subtle, but it kind of keeps on growing in your mouth. So you're like, wait, I think I need another. So it's not that salty. It doesn't taste like shrimp per se, but it has that a little bit of essence of shrimp, that sort of salty seafood kind of taste. There's other brands that make shrimp chips and those I don't really love. They are extremely salty. It almost has like this heavy MSG taste and also a little too much seafood taste for me, but you might like it. I also want to make it absolutely clear, nobody's sponsoring me, honestly. I wish somebody would. I'm just genuinely sharing my honest opinion of seokgang. Spicy one, 매운 seokgang. Mm. Everything that we just discussed now, plus a little hint of spice, it's not strong at all. It's just very subtle. It's almost like a lingering effect in the back of my mouth. Now I feel a little bit, a little bit more after like five seconds. So it's a nice balance of salt, the taste, and slice, slightly spicy taste. When I have potato chips, I love. I'm in like food heaven, but I feel guilty afterwards because it's so greasy and heavy. But when I eat seokgang, the guilt is sort of minimal. Like it's so airy. The calories are minimal compared to potato chips. But the only time I do feel slight guilty is when I inhale the entire bag. And sometimes I do. I mean, like if I had a bad day, I would get a bag of seokgang and a light cold beer and just relax, you know? Okay, here's my beer hack that I'm going to share with you. I have some light beer. Does that look good? Oh. And the foam. You do this. Look at that. It sucks it all up. This is happening in real time, folks. Look. So this is a trick that I used to use all the time when I was young, a singleton, and we used to go out, you know, drinking all the time. Look at that. Look, in 10 seconds, it's like magic. And what do you do with this? You eat it. Don't throw it away. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. Come back. Ah, that is delicious. The proper way to have our suranju, yes, there is a proper way, is you flip the bag over and you open it and you just lay it out like this. This is like the humble, no budget, low budget way of having your favorite beverage with some suranju, which is side dish or side snack that we have with alcohol. This is the way kind of I grew up having drinks in my 20s. Casual, fun, seokgang with cold beer. Try it, it's so satisfying. Oh, I forgot. If you want to buy seokgang, go to your local Korean supermarket, obviously. Sometimes regular supermarkets carry seokgang too, which is amazing. For those of you who do not live near Korean markets, just order it online. It's totally worth it. I think it's super delicious, especially with beer. Only if you are of legal age to consume alcohol, obviously. And the product links are in the description box below. And for more Korean ingredients, food, and gadgets, check out my Amazon store. Wait, don't go anywhere. Make sure to check out youtube.com slash modern pepper and you could browse to my library of Korean recipes. Click on the playlist tab and you could browse through different categories. So I will see you there so we can cook together. And I want to thank everyone for watching today. And as always, if you enjoyed watching today's video, make sure to click on that thumbs up icon and subscribe if you haven't done so. 여러분 오늘 재밌게 보셨으면 꼭 좋아하는 버튼과 구독 버튼도 눌러주세요. 다음 비디오에서 뵙겠습니다. All right, folks, I will see you in one of the videos you see right here. Don't go anywhere. Make sure to, oh, where we discuss every, these chips, 
Ugh. 